Hej. So I didn't want to be here today. But unfortunately, someone called me the other day and told me about a murder on a mountain or something. There's been a murder on a mountain or something. I thought the antics of the lemon woman ended. But it just always gets worse, doesn't it? I'm just here to collect evidence. They're never ending. A blonde woman did it. You just make my job a little bit easier. I don't even know why this noir filter is on. You know, I stepped into this stupid city, tracking her down again, and then all of a sudden I got turned into black and white. And I'm already gray, so I didn't really need this. I didn't really need this today. It's, it's all a little bit ridiculous, honestly. It's kind of stupid. I don't know, I don't know what she's trying to do, but it's a little dumb. And I'm, I'm just, uh, I'm just here to collect the evidence, so. Gray filter, gray morals. That's stupid. This whole streaming thing is stupid. I don't know, I don't, I don't know the whole, I don't know what she's doing. Like, it's, it's really dumb. I thought I'd attached myself to, you know, a, a okay thing. You'd think when you eat a, when you swallow a star in space, they wouldn't be able to get out again, and then they'd provide you with some, like, modicum of power all I get is having to deal with this stupid delinquent brat running from place to place, and now I have to go and track her down again. It's called atmosphere. I, I'm already gray. There was no... It, it, it wasn't gonna do anything. Officer Gloomy, the lemon stole my cardboard box. Yeah, that's good. That's going in the list of crimes, okay. Alright, that's going in the list of crimes. We can write that down. You have to go grayer. Only thing that Lumi gives is a sour feeling in your stomach. Would you say that's because of food poisoning? Because she she likes arsenic. She likes arsenic. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be a long list. Oh, it is. Yeah, there's a long list of crimes out there. It was a very dense star. It was. It was a very dense star. Stars don't usually come out to where I was out in space. That could be the reason. I'm just here for a list of crimes. I don't need to stay long or anything. Yeah. There's a stench about this city. And it smells like lemons. Are stars a delicacy for you? That's what black holes eat. Normal. She's just one out of a million stars. How's the case against Gremwumi? Did you know she killed a guy that one time? <sighs> Does it ever get better with these two? With this multiverse? Does it ever get any better? My job is never ending. I'm not even a cop, you know? I'm not even a cop. I was just a normal black hole in space, minding my own business, eating stars on my own, and now I'm, I'm, I'm chasing down this stupid piece of shit. Everywhere. I didn't want to do this. She ate Fishman and took his skin. It's not, that doesn't sound good. No. Impersonating a cop is a crime gloomy. Well, I wasn't a cop, but now I'm in the space police. You know, shortly after I ate Lumi, the space cops came to me and they said, hey, that was actually a wanted criminal. I said, oh, shit. I didn't really want to be tangled up in this. You know, I'm a normal person. I had a job before. Yeah, I had a job. I know she says all kinds of shit about me and she says I'm illiterate, but I had a job and a family 
and that was normal. Now I have to go through all of this. I miss my family. I want to go home. I had a job. I was a salary man, salary woman, a salary void. <laughs> Out in space. Why do you have a driver's helmet when you can't drive? This isn't a driver's helmet, stupid earthling. Dumb piece of shit. Celery woman. I was an office lady. I was just hungry that day, so I stepped out of my office to grab a snack, and look what it did to me. You had a business student and talked about sports at the water cooler. I did. I miss that life. I miss it. Yeah. My family's waiting for me. And I can't get out. I've been trapped here. You're not gonna settle down on Earth? It's nice here. Why would I settle down here? It's stupid. What do I want from you? You don't even have enough helium for me. Lumi's a bit on the denser side. When life gets inverted hard enough, happiness is measured in what you can destroy. Hey, thanks, Die Screaming. That's good advice. But I, I don't have any... I don't, I don't want to destroy anything, you know? I, I just, I just want to go home. Mummy would probably let you visit your family if you asked nicely. I don't want to be at the mercy of the whims of a yellow criminal. What? I just want to have a talk. I just want to have a talk. Black holes will only hold you for so long. And she can just come out on the other side. And then I can leave. I don't have to be here anymore. Oh, hi. Hello, fellow non-fed. Yes. Are you perhaps in need of a partner? Mm. Mm. I will entertain the offer. Maybe. Sure. So the lemon committed some crimes is a really big deal. It's just annoying. I, I'm just trying to talk to her every time I... Every time I get close, she calls me a cop and then runs away. It's really weird. Honestly, I don't know what I did. Counterpoint Earth has cookies. You think I eat cookies? Huh? You think I eat those? That's co that's calories. Yeah, what? You think I have abs like this because I eat cookies? Huh? You tried wearing a different hat. I have to wear this, or otherwise the space cops will fire on me. You know, it's actually not hard to be on Earth as a, as an extraterrestrial. There's there's laws in place. There's a whole convention. There's a whole convention. There's there's laws everywhere. You know, extraterrestrials aren't supposed to be here because you're developing, you know, species. So I have to wear the hat, or else they or else they they said they'll kill me on sight. Yeah. Gloomy's just been running for a long time, actually. Tell her you're Gloomy's criminal twin. I, you know, as 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 stupid as she is, I I don't I don't think that's gonna work. I don't think it's gonna go over well, actually. Call nice on you. She knows our weakness hats. <laughs> so, I just I just I just need some proof. I just need some proof. What flavor is Gloomy? What does that mean? What does that mean? Have you tried dyeing your hair blue? Gloomy has a type and it's blue, bitches. I'm still gray. It's pretty hard to cover this up. There's just, there's a lot going on for me. You know what? No, I have integrity. I would never dye my hair another color. I have integrity. I don't know what you go through with the other person who's on this channel, but I've got a spine. And I would never do something like that. Hmm. Yeah. The legal space immigrant Lumi send her back. Yeah, just get a wig. This is a result of collabing with Jerry? I don't think so. Are you colorblind or just hate colors? No? I don't like this gray filter thing. I don't even watch film noir. I've never seen a single film noir movie in my life. What is even so good about it? Oh, bang, bang, pew, pew, people dead. Oh, solve the mystery. Huh? It's a dumb genre. If you were gonna watch movies, at least watch something with substance. I played LA Noir, that's enough. I 
I've never been into this weird genre of stuff. I, I don't know what Lumi's doing. You can turn the filter off now. Uh, I don't know. Is there a... Is there a... Is there a button somewhere? You know, I know you're saying, Oh, haha, you can turn the filter off. This is my real life. This is my real life. I'm living it. What do you consider movies with substance? Click. By Adam Sandler. Great, great movie. <laughs> really good movie. Yeah, I like that. You know what, my family's into that. Yeah, it was a great movie. And there was this other movie with some other random guy and then they got shrunk and turned into small people. Yeah, yeah, at least she has taste. <sighs> Cone cells are disabled in the area. <laughs> you walk in and your cones just immediately disable. I think that's it. Gloomy's put up a force field. It's like, uh, it's, it's like one of those uh, worm collars, you know, the thumpers. Figures of black hole would like Adam Sandler. I've got taste. And I know you humans might not understand this taste, but more developed species, we really enjoy Adam Sandler. I think he's a visionary. I think he's really good. Yeah. You eat literally everything? No. No. I, I only eat high density, calorie full helium snacks. Yeah. You're doomed then? You eat spaghetti? Do I? Do I eat spaghetti? What have I eaten since I've gone to this stupid planet of yours? Your food is dumb. I hate food. It doesn't even make sense that I have to eat it. I should just be able to metabolize the hydrogen in the air. It's dumb. It's stupid. Didn't know Adam Sandler reached you guys in space? Oh yeah, we love Adam Sandler. That's the number one illegal export actually in space is uh, Adam Sandler movies. I don't know why you guys are so shocked, it's pretty good. 50 first dates? That's not Adam Sandler. <laughs> I don't think that's Adam Sandler. Oh, it is, actually. Yeah, you know what, it is. For some reason, I confused him with Tom Hanks. 50 first dates, pretty good. Mm. Pretty good. Uh, it's because I didn't like Drew Barrymore. Me tier. Not, not good. One of my, I like Adam Sandler movies. <sighs> see, I'm just a normal person, and I just want to go home. If you could just tell Lumi next time you see her, I just want to talk. I just want to talk. I don't, I don't want to go home. I just, I, you know, I don't want to be here. I don't want to be involved in these weird criminal shenanigans. I'm not a criminal. I'm a good person. What can you tell us about space in the universe, oh, Lumi? I don't know. It's, it's weird, it's like asking me, oh, what, what can you tell me about being from America, Gloomy? I, I don't know. I don't know. How do I know what's different for you? This is, it's not a very good question. There's no context. You gotta ask questions. Have you seen any of Adam Sandler's SNL skits? Maybe. Maybe, you gotta remember, t TV is, is very limited out in space. America is the best next question. What's your opinion on the greatest show there is, Austin Powers? Oh, I think it's pretty good. Yeah. You know, actually, I met um, Dr. Evil once. I met him. And uh, a really nice guy, very nice. Yeah. He was helping us to uh, create a, a Dyson Sphere. Make this helium birthday balloon. Thank you. Thank God. Oh, I was getting so hungry. Thank you. Can you buy these? This is, what did you call it? A birthday balloon? You can just buy this here? Just pure helium? Oh, that's nice. Where do I get this? Your opinion is correct. Congratulations. Where, did you meet a son, Scott? Uh, oh, uh, no. Oh, was that the name? See, when I, I, I met Dr. Evil and he gave me a job and uh, I remember very distinctly that he said that I should, I should go and eat something 
And I said, okay, sure, I'll just do it. No big deal. Won't even take a second. It was called Scott. It was called Scott? Okay, my bad. Um, I didn't really get to meet him. Um, I acted, I, well, anyway. Lumi sounds like she'd simp for Scott Pilgrim. Why would I simp for Scott Pilgrim? That doesn't make any sense. Isn't Scott Pilgrim famously kind of a loser? Like, that's the whole point of him, right? Is that Scott Pilgrim is a loser, and he has no spine, and he's really stupid? Yeah? Why, why would you like that? He is the sim. Why would you like that? L famously a loser. That's... Don't put your weird ideas on me just because I show up here looking like this. I've got opinions, and I will not be gaslit unless by hydrogen or helium. And his girlfriend is worn up. I thought he was with Knives Chow. Knives Chow seems cool. He's got Riz, but he wastes it. He still manages to get girls. Maybe that's because he goes outside. You ever think about that? Maybe it's because he goes outside once in a while. You know, I'm sure anyone could do it. Just go outside. Maybe because he's fictional. <sighs> Some girls really like the pathetic type. Even in even in this the company that Lumi's in, what is it called? Face Connect. Even in even in Face Connect, some girls just like the pathetic type. Yeah. He learns the power of self-respect and understanding at the end at the end of the movie, but then the comments continue, and he's still a piece of shit, right? I don't understand human literature. The characters never change. There's no such thing as character development unless it's scripted. Literal scripting. You gotta write in the character development. The characters never get a chance to develop. And then you're left at the end with still a character that's just kind of mediocre and you don't want to listen about, like, learn more about their story, but then it keeps going. And you're like, why? I don't want to know. Earth stuff is weird. The comics also ended after six volumes. Yeah, but the movie only covered, like, some of it. No, no, no. It's a bad character. If you read much history, you'll find a lot of people don't change much. Humans are dumb. I don't know why. Aren't you guys bored of being yourselves? Why don't you just change? Well, people don't change unless. What's space literature like? It's in five dimensions. Our literature goes in five dimensions. It's five dimensional literature. So you read it, but you also experience it at the same time. It's pretty sophisticated. I don't think, I, would, I don't expect you guys to get it. So in that way, when you're experiencing something in five dimensions all at once, you have to, obviously, you have to include the character growth into the writing. Otherwise it becomes very flat. Then it would be four dimensional. I think space literature is just better. Eventually, you know, humans will get out of here and, and find out, probably. Your books have smell? Yeah. Yeah. And they also move in time, too. The closest thing that you have to our literature is probably what you call VR. You just your ways gloomy. This isn't my ways, it's just how space is. You'll understand one day. You can read. I can read! That liar! That liar told me I couldn't read! I can read. I had a job. I had a life. Does space have any movie stars? Um, yes, yeah, some of the stars are movies. Yeah, some of them. Altair. You know, the Altair, the summer, the summer Triangle? Those are pretty big celebrities for us. Altair, Dina, Vega. Pretty big celebrities. The Draco star is a really big one. Yeah. I didn't know that. What movies were they in? Oh, you wouldn't understand. Sorry, I'd have to say it in star language, but I don't think that's at a, a decibel level that you can understand. So. Yeah. Um. I don't know. I can't grasp more than three dimensions. Pop up books are my limit. That's okay, you silly human. Pop up books are pretty sophisticated. At least those have three dimensions. Mm, what about Betelgeuse? 
Beetlejuices. I met the guy. That's not a star. Mm -mm. Uh, it's blue me. Do I look blue to you? You want to get your eyes checked, buddy? I'm gray. I'm gray and I've got... My, my scleras are black. This isn't blue by a long shot. Beetlejuice is a nice guy. Not that Beetlejuice. The other one. Have you seen the previews for Beetlejuice 2? No. Though, I like the first movie. Now, that's cinema. Hmm, what's it like being gray? I don't know, people keep thinking I'm evil. The, people keep walking around the, the thing I'm evil or, or, what is it called, a cosplayer or something? And I, I, I haven't done it, I'm literally... <sighs> this is just the body you get, you only get one body. Unfortunately, it had to be this one. Officer Gloomy, it's hard to hear you. Can you talk into this box instead? Your stupid human ideas don't amuse me. These antics are dumb. Oh, have you ever heard of Homestuck? No, what the heck is that? Ew. Yeah, yeah I, haven't, I haven't really spent too much time on your, your internet or whatever. Mm, in space, they tell us not to look. You know, there, there's disclaimers. Once you get into your solar system, so once anyone enters your solar system, there's disclaimers all over the place. And they say, do not go on the internet. It's full of weird stuff. You won't understand it because it's just, it's just the life form level is too low. So I, I haven't really checked the internet. Yeah, is that one of those things? Is that one of those things? See, I'm sure what Lumi did is she saw the signs, she went sick. I love breaking rules, and then she went straight onto the internet. Now I'm stuck here. I don't have any weird knowledge of it. You're on the internet? What does you're on the internet mean? Grammatically, that just doesn't check out. What do you mean you're on the internet? You're... Do I own the internet? You're on the internet right now? Well, this is a plea for help, isn't it? This is a plea for help. That doesn't mean I know what home stack is. My what? You are... I don't know what, whatever, yeah, what is, Redditor? Don't, I don't, all of these things are beneath me, okay? You have to have a high IQ to understand the literary cognito hazard that is homestuck. Okay, yeah, I'm not, I'm just not gonna read comments from you anymore, Darren, like, that's just, that's the kind of thing that makes my, oh, makes me sick to my stomach. Cognito hazard. Ugh. They're beneath all of us, but we like to watch the bugs sometimes. That's a good way of putting it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good way of putting it, I guess. Watch the bugs sometimes. How much for a strip search, Officer Gloomy? No, no, you couldn't pay me to touch it. Uh -uh. Yeah. I, I still can't really get used to human bodies. Oh, it's so squishy. Ooh. You'd like squish the human body and it presses in a little bit. And then the skin moves around. Ooh. Oh god, I'm not used to that feeling. No. See, black holes and stars, we don't, we don't have, we're not, uh, we don't, you can't touch us. We're just hot. So, no, I, I don't like the feeling of human skin. Oh, it's, <sighs> if you're not squishy, what happens if you're poked? You just go through. I'm just matter. I'm matter moving very fast, so you, you can't, you can't touch anything. Yeah. Yeah, no squish. Just, 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 just matter. I'm not squishy. I'm crusty. Haven't showered in. Oh. Oh God. Yeah, this the human the human concept of cleanliness also baffles me. You can't self clean yourselves, but you still don't want to clean yourselves. If no squish, why squish shaped? I don't know. I didn't ask to be here! I didn't want to be here. I'm just minding my own business. How do black holes get clean? We don't, we don't need to do anything. It's just, it's just, it's just how it is. Who's forcing you? I'm stuck in this body! I'm stuck in this body! 
I'm stuck in this body on this channel in this noir filter. I just want to go home. <sighs> We're stuck in our bodies too. Well, get unstuck. You should have watched what you ate. It was a mistake. Don't you ever make mistakes. Huh? Don't you ever make mistakes? Your skin will wrinkle from the rain. Why? 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 Why is that? What? What do you mean? Every day? It's not dirty energy. The most I'm emitting is radiation. A very low levels of radiation. Yeah. What do you think of star skin walking as fish? Is this a Lumi thing? Is this a You think I keep up with all her weird antics? Do you know how much stuff she gets up to in a day? Do you know how much she gets up to in a day? Really? It's embarrassing. I don't- yesterday, she, she was- she was doing stuff for nine hours or something. A lot! I- I, I just can't be- can't, can't be up with her. I have my own stuff to do. She doesn't seem like she really does much. You don't understand. You show up to one place and you see and you see her and you're like, okay, okay, let's just have our chat. We just need to have a chat, right? No. Oh. Like what? Innumerable numbers and nuclear fusion, right? So something, something, something. Mm. She just doesn't stop. How am I supposed to get through? God. There's a whole lot with a little substance, almost like a star. She, she is a star. Just a very dense one. And very useless in the grand scheme of the universe. You know, she's the sea star in a trinary system. Yeah, I've met her. I've met her older sisters, please 667A and 667B. But you know, when I met them, they said, yeah, the sea star is just negligible. Don't even ask about her. I said, okay. She's pretty small, right? I said, yeah. Doesn't even matter. You should smoke less to save your voice. I don't smoke. This is just the voices of the void. You've never been called by Cthulhu or anything? Oh, you're not into that? Do people not do that here? On Earth, there's no uh, eldritch whatevers? You don't, you don't do those? Huh? This, this is just the voices of the void. We try. Maybe you're not doing it right? You need you need an eldritch seed of chaos in order to get that going. I could probably get one for you if you really wanted it. I always appreciate the little moments I have with you. I hope they can last forever. Love you, Gloomy. Ugh. Thanks, Rue Shady, but also no thanks. I I don't I don't expect to be here for long. Yeah. My theory is she dissipates her energy radiation through her yap waves. That makes sense. That's a plausible theory. Whisper sweet eldritch whatever's into my ear. I don't think it's good for you. Ah, uh, yeah, I, I know you guys are weirdly curious, but you'll grow out of your curiosity eventually. You will. Eventually, you won't be so curious. Um, maybe... Uh, if you get out further than your own solar system, you'll probably not be. You you want to you won't want to know anymore. Yeah, humans are so silly. <laughs> humans are so dumb. Don't worry, her time is gonna be diluted. She's basically gonna be here forever. I really hope not. Exposure to Lumi has stunted our future growth. Some of you are scientists. I I don't think so. I mean, did, did any of you work in science or anything that mattered? Huh? No. I think I think you're good. Hmm. I can really feel your gravity through the screen. Oh, that shouldn't. I don't think that's how. I don't think that's how the internet works. Are you gonna catch the two chap Lumi? She's trapped my wife, my son, and my car in half. Yeah. Oh yeah, I was supposed to be here to collect a list of crimes to bring back to HQ. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
You say she chopped your wife, your son, and your car in half? <sighs> it really never ends. God. Not a gravity, my eyes are directly attracted to you. Can you not be so disgusting? This is a crime scene. Crime number one, impersonating a cop. I'm a space cop. I'm not even a space cop. I'm like a volunteer space draft. I don't want to do this either. I was the loving couple they hit. Oh. She publicly slandered me as a whore, and now all of her coworkers hate me. I don't think that's true. Uh, hey, you can make it back. You don't have to be a whore forever. Oh, you can make money in other ways, Limo. Whoring is not the only solution. Mommy ran over my mother while I was still in the womb. Oh, were you aborted? I heard there was like some like abortion baby running around. Was that you? Is that who? You oh, that's you. Hmm. Do you get paid for the volunteer work at least? There's no pay in space. Space is actually all communism. A long time ago, a man with a funny Russian accent, he showed up to space and he said, capitalism will never reach here. And then he put his communist flag down. Uh, we don't do money in space, but it, I promise it works. It's like a utopia almost. Yeah, it's all communist up there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, will me a second abortion baby has hit the stream. Yeah, no capitalism in space. Yep. Yeah. Let me will you stop me if I have the Zaza? What are you talking about? Your stupid human words don't make sense to me. I've always hated that, by the way. I've always hated that. Zaza. How old are you? Five? You're trying to cover up, you just call it weed. Just say what drugs you have. At least have some self-respect. Oh, I have the Zaza. Shut up! You're not three! You don't need to pretend. Just do your illegal things. Oh, that's why I don't like humans. So lame. It's not weed, it's fun. Oh, okay, well, just do it and don't get caught, stupid. Just call it meth, man. They also, do they also make the frogs homosexual in space? No. Um, no, I've, I've met a lot of lizards in space. They're all straight. Actually, some of them might be gay, but that's because they they uh they need to reproduce that way. You know. I thought Zaza was weed. I yeah, that's what I thought it was. It's it's weed. Did you ask? Um well they had female partners and you know some of them live in these all female communes. Um and they and they and they uh reproduce without the use of uh egg fertilization. It's it's what is it called again? It's called um it's called, uh, uh, asexual reproduction, something, something zygote, or whatever, yeah, yeah, so, some, some of the lizards don't need that, so, they have relationships with women, and relations with men, no, they, no, there's no men, sometimes, it's only for some of them, how do black holes multiply, oh, we don't, um, in order to multiply, in order to make a new baby black hole, we select a star. It's a very long, arduous process. Um, so we select a star, and then we groom the star for many years, and we make sure it gets nice and big, and then we murder the star. Oh, it's not a murder. It's more like a ritualistic sacrifice. It's not really a murder. So we have to sacrifice the star, but we gotta sacrifice it in a very specific way. So we have to hit it right in the middle, okay? Uh, so the star collapses on itself, and its gravity will turn it into a black hole. It's very, it's a really tedious process. It takes about, like a, a billion years minimum. Because the star has to be quite big. Oddly specific fetish, this is not a fetish. Why do you share a voice with who? Who are you talking about? Who? What happens if you miss? No, we don't miss. We pin it down. It's not like a star is really going to move in space anyway. What? Why do black holes merge with each other then, Gloomy? 
Oh. Well, that's unrelated. Yeah. When black holes merge, they only make one bigger black hole. It's not like you produce a whole new black hole. I... Humans are really obsessed with sex, huh? You learned about it in middle school, like during your formative years, and then you just got obsessed with it? Is that what it is? You just got obsessed with it for the rest of your lives? Why don't you get jobs? Huh? That's cannibalism? Yeah, cannibalism's pretty normal in space. Cannibalism, communism, what other isms are there? We're wired for it. Yeah, but what's the purpose of creating a new black hole? There isn't really any. If you're tired and you don't want to think anymore, you can let the other black hole think for you. Yeah. Stars are inside of a box, just like the mic goes into a box. I don't really understand this box thing. And I don't, you know what? It's not funny. I don't get it. It's just dumb. I thought they were the event horizon or something and looked like two black holes just touching. Oh, um, the event horizon is a one black hole phenomenon. It's because when you get close to the black hole, the light is being distorted around the black hole in whatever direction that you're coming from because the light is obviously coming out. If, if gravity is collecting everything at the center, you're obviously going to see the light passing you to go into the center of the black hole. It's not that hard of a concept to grasp, really. The event horizon is a one black hole thing. It's just that the, the light is being distorted around the gravity field of the black hole. Obviously, you're so dumb humans you just you can't grasp space-time distortions i don't even know why i trusted you to help me with this case honestly i'm just gonna have to do it myself where's your badge gloomy um i left it out um, yeah yeah have you gone ice skating on saturn's rings i i can't do that i'm a black hole yeah yeah why are black holes in devour it's not isn't Vor? I told you, man. I told you guys. The sex thing is a purely human construct. The space is very clean. We're all pure in space. Ugh. Just degeneracy. Degeneracy, left and right. Vor adjacent minimum. Cannibalism and Vor are not the same things. I'm free to cannibalize. I'm not into Vor. I'm not enjoying it. It's just a snack. Wow. Where we're going, we don't need eyes. Yeah, to the grave. Mm. Damn, did they recast her? Yeah. Well, I'm just not Lumi, so. Just a different person. I'm just a different person. You spend time with Lumi, but you call us Dijans? Yeah, you know, I, I see why she's so weird now. I, I like to believe that when Lumi showed up first on this planet and started streaming, she was a nice girl. Yeah. I, I choose to believe that Lumi once was a nice girl. Yeah. She didn't say anything weird. She was always sweet. And look what you did. Look what you did to her. She was a nice girl, also British. Look what you did. You should reflect on that. Think about it for a second. Lumi's a nun. It was all an act though. Was it? Was it though? Hmm? Think about it for a second. Who pushed her over the edge? She wasn't this insane always. She only had herself. She didn't have split personalities. And now look at her. Her brain's all fried. She did impersonate a nun. Who cares? Nuns are... useless constructs. Mm. We can make her worse as a joke? Yeah. Now she's losing brain cells. She calls me illiterate. She's borderline illiterate. She can't even read a book anymore. Officer, I have to report a crime. Someone has stolen Kanako Lumi's ass. Can you please get on the case ASAP? You know what? I see why she's going crazy. I see why she's going crazy now. It's all because of you. Exposing myself to dangerous levels of stupidity, as in this stream, are actively putting me at da in, in, in danger. I am, I am in danger of losing my own brain cells. 
This is all dumb. Sure. Quickly, before you're infected. Yeah. I think HQ has enough. I think HT's got enough to deal with. To trap Lumi. Here, let me see if I got this right. To trap Lumi. Trapped up a whole family in the car. Murdered another guy. She created Grem Lumi's to do her bidding. You ever see that movie? Uh, Krampus? Oh, that's a good movie. Great movie. So good. Wow, 100 out of 100. Anyway, she's got like Krampus' little servants going on. Diabolical. Not, a, not, not cool. What else has she done? He's the cutest femboy VTuber. You sound very similar. I was wondering if there was any relationship. You think so? You think so? Why don't you ask yourself that question? Why don't you take a second to ask yourself that question? Huh? Really think of hard about it. Why don't you think hard about it for a second? Huh? What a waste of money, Spencer Howard. Starting out of Sandler. Snitches get stitches. I just need a collection of crimes for HQ. I just need a collection of crimes. Mm. On Lumi. On Lumi. So I can get out of here. The, lo the levels of stupidity are just drive by abortion. <gasps> drive by abortion. You're right. You're right. What else? What else? She killed a bear. Five crimes. Yeah, she started a coffee company. Six crimes. She murdered someone and buried him in the woods. I thought that was a bear. I thought that was a bear. Are, are you talking about a bear? Drive by abortion. She killed Uruka. I hear it was Uruka's cubs. Yeah, she also read a call. Oh my God. Since I was last here, what else has she done? Last time, I think you told me a couple crimes. She stole Lucy on Christmas. Oh my God, this, it doesn't stop. Okay. She was plant, planting on government land without a permit. Despicable. She literally stole candy from a baby. She shamed us from her interest, did she? She impersonated a CEO. Diabolical. She and another star woman abducted and tortured a man. Maybe the man deserved it. Sorry, I'm more inclined to believe our space citizens than our and than these Earth ones. She's trying to run for president. That's not a crime. Anyone can do that. Here's a file I completed. LumiCrimes.xlrs 300 terabytes. Be warned, there's some heinous stuff in there. Oh, I'll add it to mine. I'm up at the- I'm up in petabytes already, so... This will be a drop in the bucket. <laughs> it was more like a couple hundred collective consciousnesses. She miscredited my hard work on Twitter once and then spelled my name wrong when she apologized. Truly, she is the most evil person on Earth. Yeah. Alright. I feel my brain cells decreasing, you know? It's, it's, I'm not doing so well. I'm gonna get out of here before we, uh, run into issues. Thanks for your cooperation. I'm gonna report back to HQ, and then I think in a week we'll be able to catch her. We'll nail her down once and for all, and maybe I can go home. Maybe I can finally go home. See you later. Hopefully never. Oh, hey, Dan Tran. One minute with a black hole is like a year on Earth. This little stream is gonna cost us 51 years. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, good luck, I guess. Let me send big salami mipples to a say-so woman. Nah. No, no. No, I don't think that happened. Thanks for stream gloomy. Nice to see you. Nice to get out once in a while, yeah. When I'm not so busy with work. Mm. Thanks, officer. Keep up the good work. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, thanks for being allies of space law. <laughs> Remember, cannibalism is okay, 
Communism is okay. <laughs> Only in space. See you next time.